Well, hello and welcome. So glad you're uh, checking in to spend some time with me today. Today we are going to uh, check out and visit a few interesting sites around Albuquerque. And the, let's head out to the uh, first place to check out. Uh, through the magic of editing, we're going to go from here to, to here. Let's look around a little bit. Check out this place. Isn't this wild? I guess this house goes by several different names. I know I know it as the submarine house. It kind of has that look to it. Got a really cool fence there. These sculptures out here are pretty awesome. Got some dinosaurs here. Pretty well put together. Yeah, pretty cool. Triceratops. A lot of pieces of metal. Don't really want to go on their property, but to see this little castle looking thing it has stairs going up it. Then we've got some cool sculptures on the other side here. I think this is a different home next door. It's pretty cool. Now oh, look at these hands. It's like a ship's bow or something. You can come out here and have a pretty good uh, view of the mountains. Yeah, I didn't get out and get a good look at these last time. But wow, that is quite a house. I would love to go in there and check it out. Walk around the corner here. I didn't even know there was anything over here, but looks like a couple metal sculptures. Kind of hidden in here. Oh, we can get a better look at the backyard over here. Wow, there's a different look on the side here, on the south side. I'd love to go up into that little tower there, see what kind of view we have. These uh, pericanthias will certainly keep you out. They've got a lot of thorns. Here's a view from the back, kind of up into the sun there. Give a full view there, pretty cool. Well, that was pretty cool. Let's head out and see if we can find the next place. Let's go. Something that just kind of popped up during my research about something else and that seems to be the best ones but we're way out to South University Boulevard let's go take a look at it have you ever seen a rattlesnake this big isn't that awesome made out of hundreds thousands of stones Wow very cool the eyes are just kind of dug out he winds all the way back there are those the eyes up there I guess those are the eyes these are the nostrils <laughs> check this out looks like some of the stones have come off or someone has knocked them off climbing on it that is pretty cool. Never seen this, never even knew it was here. This keeps going and going. That looks like it's down into the ground here. 
and back up here goes on and on it's right in the middle of an intersection of a pretty busy road not too bad right now but cars are coming look at the size of this thing this goes forever then it goes down into the ground again and back up holy mackerel I guess the diamond back design is probably seen a little better from far farther away but you can kind of see it in here the darker stones ah we're almost to the tail the rattle the rattle is about one two three four five six stones cold and windy That is the rattlesnake out on University Boulevard. I thought that was pretty interesting giant rattlesnake out on South University. Whew, it's cold. If you do come out here, uh, don't expect to find me any place to park. I had to just kind of crawl up on the shoulder here and just pray that I don't get hit. So, it's very cool to even drive by if you want to check it out. Well, on to the next uh, interesting location. A few moments later, Okay, we are at our next stop. Have you ever heard of a company called Microsoft? Well, if you didn't know, that started right here in Albuquerque. Bill Gates started this company with another partner. And this is it. Right here, 115 California. Northeast. Little plaque right here. See if we can see it. It's founded this, at this site in '75. <clears throat> Headquartered in Albuquerque until '79. Established by Paul Allen and Bill Gates. Wow. That started all the, the home PCs and the business PCs. That is pretty cool think that they came here and they're working on their programs not the best part of town but probably had a very affordable rent this is busy across the street here because this is a big old flea market at the fairgrounds off of central here but I just wanted to show you that I've never seen it I knew it was in this area somewhere but I've never come and checked it out there's not a whole lot to see other than the plaque in the building but uh, it's just really cool to imagine that uh, Bill Gates was right here, very young man, and uh, started such a huge, comp huge company and uh, changed a, a lot of lives. So I love to highlight the, uh, the good parts of Albuquerque. Once in a while, I gotta pepper in what's bad. Of course, that's the same with every city our size or, or, or larger or any any city or town has its problems but it's pretty cool to be associated with the first place that Microsoft uh, uh, started so well on to the next site let's go Now this stop wasn't planned at all. I was just in the area and I wanted to show you something here at Buffett's Candies. Something that uh, that's kind of a staple of Albuquerque. Something you see every time you drive by here on uh, on the Lomas. Lomas and near Louisiana. 
we saw a giant snake. Now we're gonna see a giant candy cane. Look at the size of that thing. I can't even get it all in the frame. It's a giant candy cane. This place has been here. I believe that candy cane's been here since the 50s. We're kind of tight on the sidewalk, so let's kind of get back a ways and check it out. Woo! Very busy. Busy, loud, noisy spot. But there's a giant candy cane. Look at the size of that thing. Woo! That is pretty cool. I've never really, I think I took a photo of it, but never documented it on one of my videos. Doesn't that just make you want to go get a tetanus shot? Check that out. That's a lot of rust. Check out these old cars. Ford Galaxy, Thunderbird, Camaro, old truck, pretty cool. Well, keeping with the theme of uh, large items, last few sites, check this out. The giant arrow. I've seen this dri driving by so many times for so many years. I actually think it's some kind of a landmark. Uh, if you look up landmarks in Albuquerque, I believe this is shown. This is incredible. It's been here for so long. The giant arrow. Sometimes people will give directions and say, oh, over there by that big giant red arrow. It's on Indian School in Carlisle. Well, I think that's going to do it for today. We squeezed in quite a few interesting sights. I did go out to the East Mountains near uh, to Harris, town east of uh, Albuquerque, but nothing too noteworthy, but took a lot of miles and a lot of time. But uh, thank you so much for hanging out with me uh, this morning, this early afternoon. I really appreciate your company, as always. So, I'm kind of worn out, but uh, hope to see you soon. I guess it's time to head on home, do some editing, things like that. Take care. Bye now.